What's up guys? It's your girl Squash876 and I am back with another video. Would have been to the center of Jamaica before? Yes, there's a dead center of Jamaica. Well if you never go there before today, we're not gonna find out where to find it and what it looks like. So journey with me now man. So guys, the center of Jamaica is in Bullhead, Clarendon, that's up in North. And I plan to ask a few persons direction to reach up there. Mind you, if I said Jamaican people don't really know a direction like that. So, let's see how it goes. But they are punking now, and anybody miss up on the road, if I stop and ask them the direction. Morning, sir. What is your name? Michael. Michael. All right. So I'm trying to reach up to Bullet Mountain. Okay. Where exactly can I find? You can follow, direct me. Follow this word straight. All right. Straight, so we go straight. Straight. And when you go up straight, it's going to be my steep hill. Steep hill. Yeah. And when you go up to straight, it's going to be my sign. My nature. And there is the part of steep hill. One sign pass is steep hill, go straight, mm -hmm. never see. One steep hill, yeah. then it's one sign pass is yeah. steep hill. It's a bullet mountain. Bullet mountain, you turn from the road and go straight to go to bullet mountain. Alright, thank you very much. Enjoy the rest of it. You want to see what gate? Like him. Ah, for this a big one. You want to see what gate? Turn, three Paris. Yeah. So you pass the steep hill up on the road eh? yes. and then you see some Paris street. Yeah. And then you go straight in. You think it's just right over there, you know, but you have to have a drive from oh, this road. But you pick around there, so. Yeah, all right. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. And I see you when I when I when I did sell pole. Eh? Oh, one did you sell pole up on mm -hmm. the steep? Up on peak. Oh, so I go see it when I drive go up. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. You will see Paris Reserve map, I believe what you will see one high and gear. Yes. Three hours later. Yeah, you have, you have one, look, look for your own right hand side. Yes. If you pass one street, you don't go. Mm-hmm. And go down to the level line. Yes. You see the, the gate, iron gate there. That carries straight to the peak. Okay. Mm -hmm. What but is your gate? name, sir? Fitz Loveless. All right, Fitz Loveless. Mm -hmm. Have a good day. Thank uh, you very much. Yeah, man. Not, not All right. Man.
Gente, amor. Boa, So guys, we finally reach the dead center of Jamaica and this monument was erected in order to signify the center of Jamaica and I have with me here my friend Jeremiah Blake from the forestry department so today he'll be telling you guys a little bit about Bullhead Mountain Okay, I chop chops <laughs> <laughs> Yes, so I'm here with my friend Sasha and she wants to know a little about the, little about the history of Bullet. Well, Bullet Mountain has been, been here for many, many years. From our great ancestors from way back when until it turned over to us now. Well, one of the main things that I know about Bullet, like you know, I said to you, is that whenever the place becomes partly cloudy and we're about to expect any rain, we are not supposed to be in the area. Reason being, the pine trees is what we call a conductor. The little tentacles that you see on them is what we call conductors. So them there are pine trees? So these are mainly the Caribbean pine trees. Mm. They formerly named called the Caribbean yeah. pine trees. They are the conductors. They, what they do, they mainly draw electricity. So when you have every rainfall and thunderstorm and all of those things, now, those are what destroy a majority of the trees within the area. Oh. So it isn't really safe to be up here when that is being taken place. What I can say to you guys, if you know that there are some pine cones here, if you observe keenly, this one is wet, these are dry. So this one wet? Yes, that one is wet. It feel cold too? It feel cold. Also, when it, two things about it. Whenever the time is wet or dry, these open. This one was in the sun for quite some time, so you know they are open. This one was actually in a cool or cold environment, so they tend to close. Oh. If you throw water on this, close up. it closes up. But it takes some time before it closes up. Oh. Mm. So this is what you'll find. These are what you'll find on the Yes, pine tree. Um, people mainly come and they kind of take them and decorate them and put for souvenirs yes and for support. souvenirs and you can put them also on your dresses and all of those things and so on yeah but there are a lot of seeds within them as well you know that mm -hmm. really um region regenerate yeah region uh, region to kind of populate the place more in the same caribbean pine mm -hmm. trees in the area oh. so those are some of the things i can even tell you about one of the main things that we also have up here is fire Yes, some time ago we have a big fire up here that destroy acres upon acres of the, of the forest and 
to get them regen back to get the place um, repopulated back we have to kind of get some more pine trees carbon pine trees from it up to plant back up here oh, so, so them near look like them recently planted yeah those are recently planted as well this monument was erected from way down from our ancestors. I could say, put from my ancestors at the forestry department. We call him from way back in the pitco time. Oh. This monument was erected. So some measurement was done from around from other different um, forest reserve reserve in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. So what happened now? Some measurement was done and Bullet Mountain yeah. was find to be the dead center of it so that's how this monument was erected yeah. <laughs> all right guys so i'm now leaving the bullhead mountain and i am down by the bottom so this is where we entered from yeah so it's the entrance and the exit to Bullhead Mountain. I'm gonna just pass one key around here, so you know. <laughs> and I don't know what they're doing around here, all windows up. Nobody knows from out here. But I hear it's a little spot. If you can <laughs> read between the lines. I hope you guys enjoy this video and see you in the next vlog.